These are the bus stops at Wilmers Lodge and they go at all the parks. At Fort Wilmers Campground I arrived at the Tri-Circle D Ranch, a course based on Mickey. As you can see this is where the horses are stabled. You can actually ride the horses as well and we're going to go in there and look at the horses, maybe see if we can find Cinderella's carriage that they use for weddings. See what we can see, this is all brand new, they moved it from the other location. Here's a beautiful, beautiful white horse. Hopefully we can see him a bit closer in a minute. And another brownie grey horse here. Hopefully we can see him from the other side in a minute. So we're just coming into the Tri-Circle D Ranch. Hopefully see some beautiful horses. They're the horses that you see in the parks, pulling the carriages and things like that. And there's all their and equipment down there. Here we can see this horse called Skyler. What does it say about him? He's a Clydesdale. This is a carriage that is sometimes used in Magic Kingdom and it plays music. So it will be a horse-drawn carriage and then it will play music as it goes along and that's on display here. Although, I don't think many people have ever seen that in the parks. This one is called Rookie. He's another Clydesdale. And he's having a little lie down and rest on the floor. Oh, proper lie down. On them, they're going to work around that same amount. So maximum of maybe four days at the week that they'll actually work. Um, so they're not this tricky. <laughs> no, no. So we do all of the horse Hello. care on top of doing all of the guest Leo. operations as well. Um, so definitely take right. a lot of pride in them and everything like that. So yeah, we definitely try to keep them in tip-top shape and as clean and as healthy as possible. Yeah, uh-huh. And it was just so much fun just watching them being groomed, yeah. and then they were trying to untie their, their leads. Yes. And, yes. Uh, this is the area where they take children for the pony rides around this track here. They're having a pony ride at the moment. But this is where it would be. And this is where they would step up on their pony. The white horse that I saw outside is called Grady. There he is. He's got his head down at the moment. Beautiful, beautiful white horse. This one's Zilly. Percheron. Is that the breed of the horse? Percheron, I think. He's a bit lively. I think he's trying to get out. He keeps banging the door. He's cleaning his teeth. Oh, he's cleaning his teeth. <laughs> On the bars. That's a good idea. A pie is there. Yeah, he's a kind of dapple grey colour, really nice. There's different horses here. Hello Phil, are you so beautiful? Having something to eat right now? Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's it, just knock it over. Just knock it over, it's empty. You've had enough now. It's empty. More food please. Refill. More food please. <laughs> he's trying to get it up. Oh, and he did it. Clever horse. A little exhibition kind of display about Walt Disney and horses, which of course he loved horses. And so there's a little 
show on the TV. There's Mickey in his cowboy outfit, Tricircle D Ranch, and there's some pictures of people having the pony rides. I think this is Walt on a polo horse, Walt with a Disneyland stage, Walt with a little baby foal. There's a nice picture of Walt with a foal up there. These are different horses. The Belgian horse, the Percheron, we just saw some of those, and the Clydesdale, which pull the very, very big carriages. Cute pictures of Mickey with horses at the ranch. Here is the Cinderella carriage with beautiful weddings. There's Cinderella with a tiny little white pony. Pictures of the ranch, pictures of Walt. And then some awards, presumably the horses have won. And there's the one we saw just a minute ago, the music playing carriage. hoping to see Cinderella's carriage but they said they keep that at an off-site location but that was well worth a visit I love it to Pioneer Hall where they used to have the Hoop de Hoo review but that's not on at the moment and over there where everybody parks their golf carts golf carts that people use at Fort Wilmot and this one is decorated so cool with a pirate theme. This might be the coolest one I've ever seen. Pitt's Tavern is the quick service. And we're going to go in here and have a drink with our resort refill. So it has a trail zone restaurant. And a Crockett's Tavern quick service, I think. Here we're going into the quick service to get a drink. Well, howdy. This is the quick service. I'm just going to get a drink, I think. Is it the shop at Wilmus Lodge, the outpost? Here are some of the golf carts people use to get around because no cars are allowed to drive. And yeah, this one is called the Meadow Trading Post. So we'll have a look inside. We are in the shop. And at Fort Wilderness they've got some different merchandise. They've got water bottles, got packs of cards. They've got these little dishes. Works of art. These collectible coins. You can get Chippendale. Fort Wilderness coin. It's a t-shirt where you could make s'mores with Chip and Dale, which I did last time at a campfire. And small please. I wish they had them in adult sizes, but they don't. Got some Fort Wilderness photo frames with Chip and Dale on, which are lovely. And a dad shirt. And Dale he is, that I already have, which you can just get at Fort Wilderness Campground and there's the backpack and a shirt some 50th anniversary candles and it's all styled in here nicely to match the theme of the campground and like you're at the mercantile in a kind of little house on the prairie sort of a setting candy at the store and all sorts of supplies for people that are camping Really nice snacks, everything you might need. They sell the fantastic Mickey bars, which I love, and Mickey ice cream sandwiches, which are amazing. Nice Fort Wilderness 
a game of checkers where you get a checkers tablecloth and the checkers are made out of pieces of wood of Chippendale a different water bottle some more t-shirts Chippendale t-shirt some football mascara magnets badges and this is some of the bulk collection for the 50th anniversary is the other tricycle bee ranch where you would come to do a 45 minute trail ride if you're too big for a pony ride and they're saddling up some of the horses here for the people who've booked a trail ride well that's a really nice thing you can do go for a trail ride all around the campground and they've got some beautiful beautiful horses and that is on the other side of the ranch to the other tricycle D new ranch that we were at brown and white horse as well that this boy is going to have a ride on this trail ride and this is right across from the central bus stops so I hope you enjoyed seeing Fort Wilderness Campground and all the horses and that will be my last vlog of the trip because the next thing I'm going to do is go to the airport. Bye!